Okay, not gonna lie. This whole battle royale thing is not quite my cup of tea. Uh, <laughs> Pac-Man, why don't you take my lead? Waka waka. Oh, uh, yeah, so, uh... <laughs> You always know when to say it the best of times. Anyway, ladies and gentlemen, this kind of came out of fucking nowhere, and being a Pac-Man aficionado as I am, and sucking royally at it, I was very much thrilled to learn that Pac-Man 99 is now a thing on the Nintendo Switch. Pretty much the next big thing since Tetris 99. Nice. So I just want to... Uh, uh, go ahead. I just want to point out, like, the sad truth about, like, as cool as this is to see, this is probably the closest thing we're going to get to a 30th anniversary gift for Pac-Man. Yeah. Most part. Also, also, I'm gonna, also, I'm throwing this out there that uh, I'm officially, I don't know what this company is called. I'm, I'm just officially calling them the 99 company, though, for now. Oh, you this mean uh, Kira? Part. Kira, that's the name of the developers who've been working on all yep. these? Uh, the same, yeah, the same fucks that made like the Street Fighter EX series, some of the more oh. recent Dr. Mario stuff, like Dr. Luigi, and now the 99 series of games. Wait, what? Also, I'm What's going to, also, I'm going to... I'm also going to do something that's horrible and try and date this video by saying I call that their next big uh, 99 project should be Donkey Kong 99. Well, <laughs> that would be kind of interesting. Well, you say that, I personally think Frogger 99 would be pretty interesting. But yeah, well, what good. he meant by the 99 series, Matt, is basically the people that made stuff like Tetris 99, Mario 35, stuff like that. I was just curious, so, what was their name again? Akira. Akira. Okay. So... What, but are are there side divisions known as Tetsuo and Kaneda? Maybe. Oh, it could if be. I do, I, what I, you I know what you're thing, I 100% agree with you. But uh, with that said, ladies and gentlemen, the whole thing of Pac-Man 99 is that, you know, play Pac-Man to your heart's content. So now you have a few other rules to worry about. For example, they brought back the Ghost Train mechanic from Pac-Man Championship Edition, which is something I wholeheartedly freaking love. Oh, it's so fun. To literally combo ghost chomping to bits. And in the process of eating all said ghosts, they will turn into Jammer Pac-Man that will be taken to every other Pac-Man player's um, play course. Ooh. Nice. Whoa. Okay, so, so I know, and I noticed we were seeing those earlier. And like the, those like those silhouettes of Pac-Man that you that go away when you uh, when oh, you grab a power pellet. So what do the Jammer Pac-Man do? They slow down Pac-Man exponentially, and the more that there are on screen, the more likely you're going to start slowing down. However, you also have a few power-ups at your disposal. Like you can literally make your Pac-Man stronger. You can make them just your dog, your box standard Pac-Man. You can increase their speed, or literally increase the amount of um, ghosts that form a train. Okay. Fun fact about me, I actually am absolute shit at Pac-Man. It took me a long time to get good at it. I mean, honestly, I will say, if you if you ever want a, like, a jumping point for the sake of um, Pac-Man, I would say Pac-Man 99 is actually a really good starting point. Just because it very is straight to the point, and for those that have the Nintendo Switch Online account, it's absolutely free! 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 Also, I, I want to point out how much free. of a double damn clutch that was, where you were able to eat up that chain right as the ghosts became tangible again. Yeah. One thing that's also worth mentioning real quick is that um, the usual fruit that you see on the course pretty much respawns all the pack dots and power pellets on, and ghost trains on screen. So oh, basically, okay. the pack train keeps on going. That's good, that's good. That is also, until you oh. give, give up the ghost. Woo. And I also noticed that, like, what I, I believe once you start eating... What's that red Pac-Man? That is a Jammer Pac-Man that will kill you upon impact. Goodness. Okay, so there are ways to, like, really up the uh, the battle. And, and the other thing I was going to say is, I believe from what I saw... Um, from what I saw, once you start eating a ghost train, it's not going to, it's not going to, like, pull a dick move on you and make the power pellet run out until that train's finished. Oh, no. Oh, wait, what did I do that for? Uh -oh. I'm an idiot. I was about to say, oh, you got super close, but I was about to say, that Number actually 13. threw me for a loop is, because normally when you grab a power pellet, all the Jammer Pac-Man, like, fade, but I guess not the red ones. The red ones will only fade away if you grab a fruit. Gotcha. Okay. Well, I mean, that already, that was pretty good, and I see you got that, you got your Cappy little, uh, icon there. Cappy? How dare you? That's a Mario Odyssey character. Mappy, Mappy. We respect the true Namco stars around here, called Namco Classics 2. Yeah, I don't get this either, folks. Some some of the, some of the um, Namco superstars that they include don't actually have their full-on names. They just call them this for whatever reason, probably due to copyright. I don't know how I entirely buy it, but yeah, that's it's Mappy. It's Mappy because everybody loves right. Mappy. They love a good old game of cat and mouse, which actually works very well with the Pac-Man formula if you believe that. I can imagine. Yeah. And that was my bad. I called him Mappy. So already, I'll see from I'll say from this once again. I appreciate how. They f how Akira finds ways to turn classic games into 
battle royales in while <laughs> while still tr while still staying true to like here's the thing worms recently released a game that was basically trying to become a battle royale but it kind of ruined what made worms cool in the first place like it made it all like real time it was no longer turn based and everyone's all going crazy here now between like three examples we've now looked at i love how akira is turning these into battle royale while still keeping what made these games classic to begin with uh, mm -hmm. So I guess that's my that's all that's all my rambling going on. Uh, <laughs> You're fine. Hype, uh, Jordy, Mad. What do you all think of this? Who wants to go first? Um, ladies first. Matt. Matt says he Matt said he thought it was cool, so that's him. Uh, off to you. <laughs> uh, it's a little flashy for my taste personally, but uh, I think this might be something my dad might like because he grew up with Pac-Man and. He used to be a big champ back in the day. I might have mentioned this in a previous video before. Nice. Oh, I know that, that. Yeah, I'd say try that. I know that uh, Paige's mom and Paige also love Pac-Man. Mm. So. Mm -hmm. I, um... Pac-Man was my thing. I, I also know Galaga was my... If they did something like this for Galaga, I'd be very interested to see how that would work. Well, you Maybe can that'll be the next one they do. You can choose the uh, Galaga character. Galaga theme. Right. Yeah. Do be wary of this, though. If you do want all these flashy Namco-esque uh, themes and whatnot, some of them including not only their original gra graphics, but also original sounds as well. But um, that being said, uh, it doesn't come free. Like, the only thing that comes free with this package is literally the base Pac-Man 99 experience in itself, which some could argue that's all that really matters. Ooh, but for a Namco yes. show like me, having all these extras is very much appreciated. Well, I mean, like, again, it, it, it's a matter of, like, it's... How to do it? How do we talk about it? it, it I, I feel like it's a it, it's free to play done right, where it's it's right. like you 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 get the free game to try out, or if you really just want to support oh, the company. Oh, oh no! Another one. I oh. literally died before I reached fifty. Oh. Whoops! Oh. Was that was he fifty? Oh, he was close. Lost simultaneous ones. But it's like, yeah, like if you genuinely like the company and the game enough, it's a single purchase, which I think is like what fifteen bucks. Uh. Fifteen bucks for uh, I know the like the like the deluxe package in full is like thirty bucks, Ooh, which dig could dig seem one. a little steep. We got Galaga, we got Dig Dug, we got oh yeah, let's try it. Uh, I'll try and, Dig uh, Dug next, and then I'll try. It. I'll always go a few rounds for this game. Otherwise, it would be kind of a short look at. Yeah. Right. Uh, no, I'll go for. Uh, and I guess we can all talk about other things. Is that another big thing that this game uh, gives you if you buy the premium one, which we were thinking of doing it, but that but it would require all of us to buy it. Is it allows you to create your own private personal matches between you and friends to compete, like the arcade yeah. classics would. Which I mean, I I would have been totally down with doing that for the sake of the look at, but I think out of all of us here, I think only Logan would be very much interested in that deal. Oh, yeah, that's probably because it's like, oh, you're targeted by a lot of people. Oh lord, time to but run. Yeah, oh, like... then how about how about this, you dig duck and suckers? Yeah. Oh jeez. But yeah, but yeah go like, ahead, I. You were I, that? I wasn't saying anything. Oh, then it was you, Hype. Go ahead, Hype. Yes. Sorry for being ha sorry for having such a white name. But anyway, um, <laughs> I will say it, you're not too far off the mark with assuming I wouldn't get a lot of mileage of it. In a sense of like, I definitely do respect a lot of what this game has, and I do remember trying. Um, it's funny that James mentioned the Ghost Trail from the uh, was it Pac-Man Championship? Pac-Man Championship Edition. Okay, it's like. Because I remember playing that, like, I do have it on Steam, and I remember liking it just fine, but it's, like, I think it's kind of, like, once that initial excitement wore off, it just kind of just stopped appealing to me, and I feel like that's probably going to be the same case for this, which is why I'm not really going out of my way to get it. But that being that's said, fair. I really do like what I'm seeing of this so far, and it is really amusing just seeing, like, some of my friends, like, really getting into this. Like, not even just James. Like, um, our friend Denny Apet, he's definitely been having a blast with it from what I can oh, tell. <laughs> I mean, honestly, comparatively speaking, Danny is very much the is very much the pack champ. <laughs> fair. So I will say, the other thing I learned or, excuse is... Me, uh, is this game calls the pack one. One. He's beginning to he's, be, he's beginning to believe. Waka, 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 waka. Anywho, uh, so yeah, I mean the other thing I guess we were talking about, which we can involve the other, we can involve Madden. Oh lordy, Lou, here it comes. Whoa. Which we go. Which we can involve Whoa. Matt and Jordian is what other now that now that we've seen that they're even able to start branching out from just you know Nintendo, because I, I don't know, I always I always I always looked at Ghosts and Goblins. Ghost of Goblins. Oh my god, that would be... <laughs> that is gonna be a massive hell to undertake. That would be insane, Both dude. figuratively and literally. Yeah! I forgot Ghost of Goblins was in the arcade, technically, like, oh, by geez. itself. Uh-oh! Nice. Oh. 
Yeah, you know, those jambers can re those jambers can really get you in the in the pickle every once in a while. Here, here's my Especially problem. Especially when the red though. ones start popping up. Here's careful, red pack man. Two, two red just... pack man. Three red pack mans. Careful. I'm just. Ah, not... uh, they're blocking the way. Yeah. Keep here's knocking, Matt. Here's Go my ahead, big problem. Talking. I'm just not a fan of the battle royale genre. Too. Ah! Oh. Fuck you. Okay, that's I mean, that fair. is fair. That is totally fair. I, I, I will say I'm not a huge fan. I'm not a big fan of like the. Sh typically, I'm not a big fan of the shooter. Of the shooter uh, battle royales because uh, the issue is that you know in most cases it is cool. I've, I'm running around on this massive map for 40 minutes and I'm waiting to find somebody. Oh, I just got sniped from across the hill after 45 minutes of wandering uh, around. Yeah. Like so, so it's 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 really like un it's really hard to be engaged the whole time. But I but I will so I will give oh, Akira. Oh. But I will give You're Akira. So close. I, I will give Akira the benefit of the doubt. Not bad for that. I'll give them the trust, the Ooh, fact that like up. with their games, hey. you are actively engaged in gameplay from start to finish of that round. And it's great. It's a nice burst of of energy. Uh, was there any? Was there? I guess. Did you want to do like another couple rounds, James, or like one more? I I think I'm. I have it in me for at least two. At least two more rounds. Okay. Okay. Uh, well, but yeah, I guess. One the back there. Huh? Oh, this one, uh, Cosmo Gang the video. This is this is actually oh. based on a type a Galaga like that involves kooky looking aliens. Welcome to Amphibia ah. the game. <laughs> I need to actually watch that show. I heard it's amazing. And you know what? I'll take this opportunity to show off some of the other modes that this game has to offer. Oh yeah, Assuming check it you out. do get like the uh, bundle, like oh, the score out. attack. Basically, it just becomes it, it basically becomes regular Pac Man. Wait, I saw oh, one. fair enough. I, I saw one. <laughs> Yo, go ahead. I saw one of the options said blind time attack. What's the difference between a regular time attack and a blind one? Uh, I'm not entirely sure. I, I'll admit, that's actually the one mode I never tried out before, but you know what? Maybe this could be a look at first. Maybe. Let's try it out, yeah. But yeah, and then go ahead, Matt. Uh, one more Capcom game I was thinking of that'd actually be a really cool idea. Uh, was, uh, Street Fighter. Street Fighter oh, yeah. would be interesting. Oh, oh, I forgot the original one back when it was a beat 'em up. No, 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 oh. no, 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 no. I thought I'm, it was I'm... there. Street Fighter was a beat 'em up before it became like the well, two. Yeah. The, uh, the one one sort of. I mean, technically, like with the very original Street Street Fighter, it was well, it was very much the progenitor of the of the fighting genre as we know it today. And then, technically, what was supposed to be its sequel ended up becoming Final Fight. Yeah, but no, oh, I'm talking. Okay. And then I'm we got the real Street Fighter too. I'm talking about, like, make either, like, make the attacks be super-powered and stuff like that, and eventually the, uh, the different attacks and all that, like, basically have two people fight each other throughout the map just continuously. In fact, make it instead of, like, 99, 100, and all that, to make it all even, and make two people, uh, fight, Oops. and then, like, as it's going on, more people are getting more eliminated and all that. So, it's, so, so, so it'd be, so end. it would be a, it would, so it would be a rapid-fire tournament bracket. Exactly. Until you have mm -hmm. the one out of a hundred that, I could see that working. I, yeah, I could, the, the I could see ways two. they could make it, like, lightning rounds. I yeah. can't help but feel like fighting games already do that to some degree. Well, well, not no. well, not to not to like a lightning round kind of. I feel like yeah. that would be the appeal is like doing like a hey oh I want to I want to I want to like if you go to a tournament usually it's like oh this is a three hour long tournament that I have you know watch seventy people but imagine if it was like the uh, the appeal of a tournament but it's over in like five minutes. Hmm. I could see I could see it working. Uh, let me look up other classic arcade titles. I already I already offered Donkey Kong because I could see it where like. There are more obstacles for Jumpman to go through, a la Mario 30. What was it Mario 31? Um, 33? Mario 35. Yeah, Mario 35. 35. 35. Thank you. Uh, did you have any suggestions for what you would like to see for something like this, Jordan? Yeah, it's like a blind time attack. Go ahead. Jordan. Um, one thing that came to mind that would fit this aesthetic and I think would work in terms of the flashiness, uh, part of my uh, terms, but uh, what about Choo Choo Rocket? Oh Choo -choo my God! Rocket. Oh, oh, actually, I oh that. Choo -choo. yeah, I, I could be... honestly see it. That would be interesting. Oh, I, I'd be curious to see. The, the only one I remember was the 3D one, which I think was on the GameCube. Mm -hmm. uh, Hi. I, um, I, uh, I have a question. What the fuck is Choo Choo Rocket? Oh, okay. It's an uh, old Sega game. Oh uh, yeah, yeah, it's a Sega game. The, the way it works is that you, uh, it, it's it's a fun multiplayer like kind of action. Oh, jeez, the beat up guys. Yeah. <laughs> it, it's a it's a fun uh, it's a fun like kind of puzzle game in a sense. Matt, the way it works is is you you don't control anything except for a cursor like a point and click and 
you're trying to put down arrow tiles to lead the choo-choos uh, okay. into your rocket pod, but other enemy players can also put down arrows to try and lead it away from okay. yours and into theirs. I am and it becomes a whole the chaos. I literally just looked it up. I have never seen this game before. It looks intriguing. Really? It looks weird. It's, I have yeah. never seen this. Well, I do know Sega does like referencing it now and then. Like, I think if I'm not mistaken, they weren't the weren't what? How much is like? Wasn't one of the Choo Choo Rockets a playable character in the All Star Racing Transformed? Uh, literally like a gang of four of them on a rocket ship. I, you know what? I think I figured out now what blind time attack is or how it works. What is up? You don't actually get to see what your score is, I think, until after the time limit. I'm I'm curious about how it works. I think you just gotta keep you just have to like literally keep going until you've literally run out of time. It which in the process you can't extend your time by eating eating as many ghosts as you can. Right. Honestly, by that yeah. aspect, why isn't it? Why then they just call it like a regular time attack if the blind aspect isn't really that much different? There's something to it, I'm sure. But for now, I'm gonna look up classic arcade games and see what other uh, titles I could see. Like you said, Frogger. Uh, I could. Yeah, I agree with. Uh, Frogger '99. Yeah, I, I. I feel like we joked about that at one point or another. I, I did. In fact, I think I was the first one that joked about it. I believe day, so. Yeah. One day we'll get that. Uh, I could see freaking Space Invaders and or Centipede '99. <laughs> Uh, Tuber uh, 99. Castlevania? Uh, maybe. I'm, I'm, I'm thinking of, like, you know, moment to moment, like, not a big that's story, fair, like, fair. just a quick, uh, like... Galaga 99? Like... Oh, God. No, I just had the... What's real that? talk, I just had the most out there sort of thing that'll never happen, but I kind of want to see how it would turn out. Mm -hmm. Jungle Beat 99. Jungle? What is it? Donkey Kong Jungle Beat. Oh, oh Jungle, Jungle, Jungle Beat! Like, yeah, it, like, it, like, it, I'm not gonna lie, it, like, it like, like Discord kind of made some... Like, Discord kind of made it sound like you only just said Jumby, and I'm like, Jumby? No, no, so Jungle Bee. Jungle Bee? <laughs> no, I don't know what Jumby is. Interesting. No, appar apparently he wants a Jumby 99. Mecha Lekka Die. No. Mecha Die. Jumby. No, oh! Wait, wait, I got one. I got one. I got one. Mm -hmm. What's I got that? one. Mm -hmm. Well, like, imagine it were like oh. a regular thing, oh. and then you could have it as like a DLC. So, Pinball and Sonic Spinball. A pinball 99 would be interesting. I could, I could see how they could pull that off. But anyway, you got tier 10. Wait, nine, nine, no eight. eight. No, what was it? Or how seven. many emblems are there? Seven. Okay, just seven. Darn. Seven. Just eight. seven. Oh well. Uh, the only other one I could think of would be maybe a pole position 99. But the pole position is basically Pac-Man in 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 Seoul anyway. Yeah. I mean, yeah, literally is. Uh, oh that wait a said, minute, Cubert. <laughs> I just said, I'm pretty sure I you said Cuber a little while ago. Oh, I forgot. Yeah. I'm sorry, I missed okay, it. Okay. I missed it. Might it. Have been a, it might have been a different video, though, is why you didn't hear it. Try sorry, it. One it. more for all the monkeys. Yeah, one more One more for all the One more for all the power pellets. Here you go. All the fruits, all the bananas. I'm trying to think, like, bananas. so I know me, Jordan, and Matt gave suggestions. I think Logan gave out his, actually, hang on, me, yeah, it was me, Matt, and Jordan that gave some, Logan that gave out. Are there any that you wouldn't mind seeing, James? I know I brought up, j just as a joke, literally Jungle Beat, like Donkey Kong Jungle Beat 99, because the whole point of that game is literally a score attack. Right, mm. right. And just see, like, see how many, like, I mean, that again, it probably would be a very tough sell, considering that I even did not barely acknowledge it anymore. Yeah. Um, honestly, beyond that, um, hmm, I'd really have to get back to you on that, but it'd have to be something, like, very arcade-like in nature. Like, anything, like, I will say, like, I don't know if I brought this up already, but I always, like, uh, they're after, about the, to turn. after we did the... No, no, uh, see, as you're seeing right there, if you, if you look at the center circle, when he starts eating a chain, uh, it does give you enough time to keep that power pellet, because wouldn't that be a dick move? Yeah. Oh, it would that be would, a dick move. That would royally suck. But, um, yeah, I was, I was, I was, but yeah, no, going back to my thing earlier, as much as I do appreciate Super Mario 35 for being a thing... It honestly didn't have that big of a shelf like considering the fact that it was it was based more on a game type that doesn't lend itself the best at the battle royale form, format right. unlike say Pac-Man or Tetris. Right, it's more long form so hence why I, I think more something like say Donkey Kong since it's all about like trying to climb up as fast as you can. I feel like that one would work a bit better or uh Balloon Fight 99. Get the chain. Oh, I can see Balloon Fight. I can see Balloon Fight working. I could see Ice Climbers 99. <laughs> Maybe. Uh, <laughs> improve the improve the controls, and I'd buy it in RP. Yeah, I could see that working. Uh, I'm trying to think what else. Um, I could see. 
Uh, we, again, I already mentioned Galaga. Any shoot em up I could see working. You as know well. what? I, I just thought of <laughs> just to test the limits of how dedicated the Devil Lane fan base is. F099. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, goodness. I mean, we'll take. I mean, uh, F0 fans will take it. Yes. I mean, <laughs> also, honestly, we'll... I mean, honestly, forget the 99 shit. Let that just be a bonus mode for a new F0 game in general. Yes. Yeah. I, mean, there, there, I mean, there's your excuse to make a new one. Actually, you know what? And I know exactly how they, how they could pull it off. Uh, I, I, I know exactly how they could pull it off. Hype. Remember, uh, a long time ago, we did a look at of that really cool game, Split Second, the like Michael mm -hmm. Bay racing kind of game. They, they, they have a game type where the whole premise is, the, the whole premise of it is, oh, red one in the upper left. Uh, the whole premise of it is. Whoa. Oh, that was close. That's uh -oh. nice one. Anyway, say anyway. about the premise real quick. The, the premise is that the premise is that you oh. have to win the oh, you don't so have to win the race is that in order to get I, further into wow I cannot fucking believe this it's 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 it's, it's like fucking curse. fate that the very for the very last match in this fucking Pac-Man centric thing I got pinked <laughs> what's pinked? No, pink uh, he pink. he got hit by I, Pinky I oh. thought he said something else too much oh. pink energy is dangerous. But, but yeah, I but yeah. Oh my god, it's like it's like Pinky's Pinky haunts me every time I see her. Every time, but yeah, no. And again, the premise I'm is just to win the up race, you, big boy. To win the race, it's just you had to be faster than the slowest person in the back of the line until all the races were eliminated. I could see working like that. But I'm anyway. so sorry, by the way. Ah, you're, you're fine. fine. Yeah, that's, that, that's the. I will ask James. Have you won a Pac-Man '99 match so far yet? I was really damn close. Like at least on two separate occasions, I was able to make it to number two. Damn. But I ended up was I was like literally one Pac-Man short from becoming the Pac-1. Darn. In Actually, any case, the, this still is this still is really nice. It has a nice about personality to it. I love it. I have a question. Is there a Puyo Puyo number 99? Uh, Tetris 99 uh, is the closest thing we have. I know. I uh, but because of Tetris 99, which started I this whole think, trend. I think the closest thing we have to that is uh, Puyo Puyo Champions. But even then, I don't know if that's really considered the uh, Battle Royale or not. I, that's fair. If, I feel like it's only a matter of time, though. Oh, yeah. No, because I, yeah, I didn't even think about that. You're right. That would work as well. On that note, ladies and gentlemen, that is it for our look at on Pac-Man 99 for the Nintendo Switch. Um, honestly, as we've said before, if you have a Nintendo Switch Online account and have at least any sort of attachment towards Pac-Man, I would not recommend this enough. Okay. And I, I, mm -hmm. I definitely enjoyed the showcase. Now, now that I know how it works, I definitely appreciate what they how they pulled this off even more. Also, yeah. From the On background, that, they... from the background, it looks like the ghost got really long. It's like, help! <laughs> they truly have given up the ghost. So, uh, yeah, with that said, ladies and gentlemen, see you all next time whenever we cover Splatoon 99. Ah! Oh, yeah. boy! That Bye. would actually be fun, now that I think about it. Don't forget, he called you pink. <laughs>